Hello. And welcome to Earthbound. Now I have never played this so I have no idea what it's going to involve, but it looks like there's aliens. If the audio is a little choppy, sorry about that. If the audio is not there, uh, I'm even more sorry about that because uh, I tried my very best to get this audio working. You know, I recorded a full half hour of this before realizing the audio didn't work. And uh, I was going to upload it to YouTube, but then I realized my mouse cursor was like literally in the middle of the screen the entire time. Well, you'd think I'd notice that, but honestly, uh, oh, that, was, that was the old one. Why is it not going? Let me. All right, cool. That works. You'd think I noticed that my cursor was there, but when I'm screen recording, the cursor just disappears whenever I hit a button on the keyboard. But it shows up in the video for some reason. Fast. Uh, let's just speed run this. Mono. I've only got one ear button. Plain, because I'm boring. Hit the don't care, because I want the like, cannon names. Name her. I don't care. Parla, got it. And my guy, Jeff. Jeff Jeffs. And this dude. He looks really cool. Let's name him Pooh. And King, is it? Yeah, King. Now this I'll make myself. It's gotta be the legendary drink spelled with a y now if you don't like drink you're a complete loser my favorite thing hmm it's got to be youtube subscribers subscribe let's go <coughs> perfection Let's get earth bounding. We got a town. We got eerie noises that you may or may not be able to hear, but I really hope you do. The year is 1990-something. Bornet, a small town in Eagle Land. Night. <coughs> Some trees and whatnot. Exciting gameplay. My viewer attention is going to be off the charts. Cool little house. Ness's house, that's me. So I've seen the first half hour of this game, so I know what's going on here. Time to wake up. Oh wait, there's a sound, isn't there? Did you hear that? I hope you did. It was like a meteor. Probably because it was a meteor. Time to rob my family. Let's go. What's up? Hey bro, did the sand wake you up? Were you freaked out? No, I'm just here to rob you. Gimme. A cracked bat. Let's equip it. I think weapon, cracked bat. Cool beans. Let's get going. Who are you? What was that noise? Ness, you don't seem scared, are you nuts? Indeed I am. And now you want to go check it out? Oh, okay. You'll sneak out of your room anyway, even if I ask you not to. At least change out of your jammies before you go. Thanks, Mom. My mom was incredibly cool. What's up, King? Besides humans, dogs also sleep at night. Why aren't you asleep? I am not human. There's, look at me. I'm clearly... I'm a skeleton. Sans the skeleton. Alright, let's get going. Meteor time. 
Who are you? Did you hear the Big Bang? I think a meteorite landed nearby. I want to be the first to see it, okay? I'm going to try to be the first to get there. Too bad. I'm going to beat you. Lol, nerd. Oh, wait. It's down, isn't it? Maybe it will beat me. What up, copper? Oh, I should probably talk for the dialogue. I've, I've read it all, but you guys haven't. Don't you know what time it is? Get your butt home pronto! No. I'm not feeling it. What was up, cop? Meteorite has landed. The sharks are running wild in town. You kids are wandering around and I'm hungry. I hate my job. I feel you, man. It's dangerous to go to the hilltop. Even if I advise you not to go, it won't stop you, will it? Nope. Because I'm an idiot. Let's do this. Hey. Hey, you. Don't you know what time it is? I don't, actually. What time is it? Bro just straight up doesn't tell me. Oh, I should check this, shouldn't I? <gasps> bread roll. I love bread. I'm a bread enjoyer. Well, who's this dude? Hey, Ness. Hi, buddy. Meteorite fell down and went boom. It was a real mess for a while. I was fine because I always eat garlic and work out to help make my body stronger. However, the weaker citizens probably fainted. I also want to tell you, <laughs> whoops, I almost told you about my, uh... By the way, Ness, did you check my billboard? I wrote the message myself. You can read? That's my real job, you know, I'm a billboard guy. Why don't you check out my work? I like this dude. He's so full of himself, it's funny. Treasure Hunter, this is Lear X Segarate's house. Nice job. I didn't know you could write. Cop. What? That meteorite looks different than usual. Different than usual? How many meteorites land around here? Is there like one a day? Strange and marvelous, as well as mysterious. Ooh. Got it, man. What are you talking to? Who's this idiot? Hey, Ness. Don't be rubbernecking, you're getting the cops- oops. I mean officers away. You can go home now. Tomorrow, I, Pokey, will tell you more about the strange meteorite. I'm fine here, but you're bugging the officers. I was trying to talk to the officer, you're in my way. Shh, shh. Got it, okay. Nice timing, Ness. Will you do something about Pokey? He's driving me nuts. Are you two friends? No, I hate him. You're not friends, but aren't you neighbors? Come on, help me out of here. No, I hate Pokey. Clear out, get in my way, clear out, get in my way. Whoops, my mistake. I mean, oh, <laughs> clear out, out of a way out, get my, get out of my way, got it? Pokey's just literally trapping me in this corner. Nice one, Pokey. I hate you, Pokey. No one in this neighborhood likes Pokey. Alright, let's go. Let's go home, I guess. Ooh, exciting plot progression. I get to walk home. My viewers are going to love this. Can I get in a car? Oh. It'd be really funny if I could just steal a car. Oh, there's, there's people here. I want to return home, but the road is closed. People are taking this meteorite situation too seriously. Yeah, I bet. South to the suburbs of Onet. Alright. Onet police are inf infamous for closing roads if something is going on. We are going for the world record. Good luck, boys. <laughs> Don't panic, it's just a... What? Meteorite that... Who uh, fell? I just wanna... What? Go, go home. You gotta set the world record for roads closed, man. You can't give up yet. You're almost there. Hey, Mom, what up? Welcome home, Ness. It's not necessary to talk about it tonight. It's late. Scoot off to bed now. Alright. Later that night. My man Ness gets no sleep. What's up? 
Someone's knocking at the door. What an annoying knock. Kel, it's Kel. We gotta talk to him. My lad, who could be knocking at the door at this time of night? Would you answer it? You answer it. You're the adult of the house. Come on, loser. I got fleas sucking me dry, so I'm just gonna lie still for now. Skill issue. Oh no. Not this loser. Hey, hey, l listen to what I've got to say. When I took Picky to the place where the meteorite landed. Oh. Oh, g good evening, ma'am. You're looking lovely as usual. <laughs> uh, and anyway, as I was saying, uh, the police that were guarding the meteorite landing left suddenly to deal with the sharks. You know, the sharks are the local ruffians, and they were really going wild. Suddenly, I noticed the picky was gone. I blame the cops. It certainly wasn't my fault at all. When my dad gets back, I know I'm gonna get it. You're my bestest friend. Won't you help me find picky? No, I hate you. If you refuse me, I'll say something that'll cut you like a knife. Will you come with me? Okay, I won't say anything to hurt you. But will you please come with- Ah, uh, we're gonna get a looping dialogue, aren't we? Okay, good buddy, let's blow this popsicle stand. Before we go, why don't you shake and say goodbye to your mom, don't you agree, ma'am? Now let's just leave. Oh, he's blocking the door, I hate him. I know that the dog is unreliable, but you should take King along. The cracked bat in Tracy's room could help out at a time like this. I already stole from her, don't worry. No matter what anyone says, you're a, sh a courageous, strong boy. You're my very own natural-born fighter. You'll go far. Remember to go for it. But I think you should change out of your jammies before you leave. You have poor taste in clothes. My jammies are incredible. I did not mean to do that. What up, Paula? I'll do everything I can to help you. Good luck on your adventure. You might get hungry along the way, so here is a cookie. That's got the cookie. You can also leave anything you don't eat with me. Do you want me to... Uh, no. Be careful. Thanks for the cookie. Yeah, sure. You're cool. Whatever. Alright, let's go. Alright, you go in front and I'll follow at a safe distance. Let's get going. Bokey joins you. Aw, oh, come on. I don't like him. Get him out of here. Yeah, let's go, King. Guess I have no choice. Let's go. King joins you. He's just the better Pokey. That's all there is to- Oh. Mike. Ness, answer the phone. Hello, it's your dad. Work to exhaustion when you're young. Have you ever heard of a weird saying like this? Just remember, I'm always behind you 100%. Don't be afraid. I know that you're brave. You can do it. Don't forget to call me periodically during your adventure. You can make a record of your progress when you call me. Oh yeah, I deposited $30 into your bank account. Do you have your ATM card? Why would I have that? Withdraw your money from any cash machine and buy whatever you need. Yo, thanks, Dad. Good luck, my boy. I feel like such a hero. What? Well, the father of a hero, at least. Home wa ha ha. Slam beef. Got it. Am I a hero? I'm just, I'm just looking for whatever his name is. Picky. Ah, uh, dog. Kill it. King Realm. Oh yeah, King's carrying. I did it again. No. Oh. Pokey are useless. Pokey hit it. Cool beans, we win. I just hit X a lot. I leveled up. Hooray. I, I learned the power of something or other. I don't know. I don't care. Where we go? Same place. I love this dogs walking animation. Oh, a snake. Let's beat it up. Biting attack. Too bad I'm too cool to get hit by you. Pokey pretended to cry. Of course he did. He sucks. I hate him. 
Oh yeah, crit. Pokey King and I are carrying. You gotta do something, okay? Please, you suck. You useless old bird back there. Oh no, another one. Man, this is exciting. Time to spam attack. Pokey apologized, right. Good thing I'm here, you'd be dead, Pokey. <coughs> oh, it's up here, right? Hi, what's his name is here? Anus. I was too busy to investigate, but I heard a child's voice in the hilltop. I'm a busy man, but when I do a job, I do it well. I'm a man's man. You are, sir. You are the best. Is that what's his name? Up there. There's holes everywhere. Maybe meteorites do land every day in this town. A woof. If I knew this was going to be such a scary place, I wouldn't have come along. I'm out of here. No. You were carrying this team. Pokey's useless. Pokey sucks. What's in here? Caution. There's still lots of fires burning here and there. It's hot. I bet it is. It's a meteorite. What? Oh, you woke me up. Pokey, I've been looking all over for you. You see, Pokey got scared and ran away. I bet he did. I bet he did. Well, I'm glad that you're okay, at least. Let's go home now. I bet Mom and Dad are worried sick about us. Jeez, sometimes I wonder which of us is the real big brother. Pokey, I love you. You're the best. Pokey joins you. He's just the better Pokey. Ness. Do you hear a buzzing that sounds like a bee flying around? No. Oh, come on, you must hear it. Oh, I do hear it, yeah. Watch as rules card spawns in. Nope, it is a bee. A bee I am? Not. Oh, come on. I'm from 10 years in the future, and in the future, all is devastation. Gigas, the universal cosmic destroyer, sent all to the horror of eternal darkness. However, you must listen. Where I am from, there's a well-known legend that has been handed down from ancient times. It says when the chosen boy reaches the point, he will find the light. Passing of time will shatter the nightmare rock and will reveal the path of light. You see, it is my opinion that you are that boy, Ness. This, I believe. Gigas's monstrous plan must have been set in motion somewhere on Earth. If you start to confront the enemy immediately, you may have time to counter the evil intentions of Gigas. Three things are of utmost importance. Wisdom, courage, and friendship. The legends from the very ancient times tell of three boys and a girl who defeat Gigas. I will tell you more later. Go now, and do not be anxious about the future. You have much work to do, Ness. Did you listen to what I told you? I did, yeah. Thank you for listening to my long story. You are as exceptional as I expected you to be. I am awesome. Pokey kinda sucks, though. I hope he's not one of the boys. Buzz Buzz now joins you. Alright, Buzz Buzz, let's do this. Ness! It looks like you're really in a lot of trouble this time. Three boys, he said? Uh, I'm not one of those three. I might do not be one of those. Please do not, I can't stand you. Because I'm not into this guy. Oh, thank God. I won't have to deal with him. Jeez, my heart is almost pounding right out of my chest. Yo, own um, Pokey. I'm taking Picky with me. He's the better pokey brother. This dude's like a laser beam 17121 from Plebeian Animation. Man, I don't really like to do that kind of thing. I'm more of a video game type of guy, if you know what I mean. Hey, if you haven't watched Plebeian Animation, you should watch Plebeian Animation. I'll put a link in the description, like a YouTuber or something. It's my hit movie featuring me.
Now that's rules card. It's been a long time, Buzz Buzz. You've been successful at foiling Master Gigas's plans, but to Buzz Buzz, you must now surrender. You're no longer a hero, but just a useless insect. I'll stomp you on. Starman, right? Yeah, Starman. He's got the thing on his chest that means something, but I think Papyrus has it in Underdale. Cool psychic shield, etc. Picky's doing magic, Pokey's being useless. <coughs> oh yeah, Buzzbuzz carrying, as usual. Look at that, look at that, come on. At least Picky's trying. What is this? Dude's using big crushed sound effects against us. Thank you, Buzz Bows. Yeah, look at him, he's trying. Look, he's not. Look at that, look at that. Easy peasy. With Buzz Bows at least. Cool level up. <coughs> Ooh, I was taking a big chance there. He came from ten years in the future to kill me, so we can't relax yet. From now on, you'll be fighting enemies sent by Gigas, as well as humans who have ill thoughts. I'll definitely make trouble during your adventure. Animals are also becoming violent due to Gigas's influence over the evil in their minds. It is the truth, so listen. I'm listening. Let's get you home, Pokey, and better Pokey. This is their house, right? Oh, this is my house. I thought I lived farther. Oh, right, yeah. There's this down the street here. Oh, wow, luxurious. Look at this. Who are you? I like you. I'm really sorry that my kids troubled you so much. Both of you are really gonna get it now. Yeah, beat him up. Oh dang, dude's violent. By the way, I'd be happy if you left sometime soon. I'm tired of your family living next door. We've loaned your father a lot of money. It may have been a hundred thousand dollars more. My father's paying me. Pay off your debt first, come on. Well, I guess it really could have been less. But because of the load, my family now live in poverty. Look at the size of your house. It's massive. You have lamps and couches and rugs everywhere. You do not live in poverty. My husband is much too lenient with children. Oh well, nice guys finish the last. That's the story of our life. Oh my god, I hate them already. Aye, I think it's a dung beetle. I'll smash your guts out. Oh no, buzz buzz. No. No, Buzz Buzz. Oh, I hate you. <laughs> I was much weaker than I thought. So you must now begin your adventure. See, see you. Oh, I just remembered. Listen to my final words. To defeat Gigas, your own power must unite with the Earth. The earth will unchannel your power and multiply it. The right points that you must visit make these places your own. Each of these locations is your sanctuary. One of them is near your own net. It is called the Giant Step. Go there first. Do you understand? I got it. All right. You're a very intelligent young man and... Ah, oh, the pain. Everything is getting dark. Before I pass on, I want to give you something. It is the sound stone. You can record the melodies from your to your sanctuary locations into the stone. It is an awesome item. By the way, I'm almost gone. But did you want to hear the story one more? No. Good. It's already dawn outside. But it doesn't matter to me, I'm fading fast. <sighs> 
Nice got the soundstone. Buzz Buzz just straight up died. Dude did a hundred some damage to the star man, and he got one shot by this thing. I'm leaving. I can't stand them. Like, they're worse than Pokey. Pokey's whole family sucks except for Picky. Hmm. Cool. That's the whole prologue. Oh, something's happening. Ah! <gasps> Who the heck is this? Picture is taken instantaneously. I'm a photographic genius if I do say so myself. Okay, get ready for an instant memory. Look at the camera. Ready? Ready? Say. Fuzzy pickles. Fuzzy pickles. Ah, look at that. Wow, what a great photograph. It will always bring back the phone just to memories. I don't get it. You just leave it? Oh, I like that dude. You are a cool dude, photographer. Wow, instant memories. I'll remember that. What up? You're back! Don't bother yourself with talking now, you look too tired. Mothers understand these things. Eat some drink and scoot up to bed. Alright. Sleep all day, let's go. Cool beans, slept in my clothes, backpack and all. So. Good morning, sleepy bones. Bones, I knew I was sans. It's canon. Are you ready to start your adventure? I'm so proud of you, my little man is growing up too fast. I'm not ready to start my adventure. I think I'll just... How long have I been playing? A while. I mean, not that long, but still. Looks like it's about to like really start, so I'll save that for next time. Thanks for watching, everyone. No, no, no. Thanks for watching, everyone. Like and subscribe for more. I will continue, so... Hit that bell or whatever. No one hits the bell. Yeah, that's it. Cool. Bye.